What is going on everybody? How are we all doing? And welcome back today to a brand new Inform player review and this time we're taking a look at just the second Inform Son and I say just because he's had that many special cards it's unbelievable he's got two Man of the Matches, he's got a Player of the Month card but this is only his second in form. He's having an incredible season for Spurs. This is now an 88 rated version of him, which looks insane. And if you do enjoy the review, lads, as always, smash a massive thumbs up on the video. And don't forget to subscribe if you are new around here. But we're going to kick things off with the basic information. And for Son, he's done it at six foot tall exactly. He's got high to high work rates, three star skill moves, which are rumoured to be upgraded to four star, which would be a massive plus if they were. And also that fantastic, beloved five star weak foot. But looking at his base card, and his top 5 in game stats like I've already mentioned is an 88 rated card, he is a left mid, I know he's had a couple of versions that have been strikers but this one is a left mid unfortunately, he comes with 92 pace, 90 dribbling, 92 shooting, 87 passing, 80 physical and 40 defending and his top 5 in game stats are 99 heading accuracy which really surprised me, he's got 99 stamina, 98 curve, 97 long shots and 93 dribbling and the traits and specialities that he comes with are the finesse shot, long shot taker and speed dribbler. Looking at the team that we used him in on screen here because it's a 4-3-2-1 setup all Premier League and in the five games that he played with Son he came away with a very very respectable nine goals and two assists as well and starting to roll some of the clips of Son in action it's um it's incredible really how much this card has been upgraded since the player of the month card which I also re reviewed and used quite frequently when you look at the stats this card's got compared to the player of the month one like I said the upgrades are absolutely ridiculous however he does still have a couple of issues that that player of the month card does have and that is the fact that he's only got three star skill moves like I said just there is rumours that they'll be upgraded but I feel like that happens every single year so still three star skill moves for now which is a big downgrade strength isn't fantastic he's not massively weak but he isn't strong either and also the, the, the work rates now with this card, they're a little less effective than they are with the player of the month card. And that's because when he picks up the ball in deep positions where normally you wouldn't want him. Because this card is so incredible, he's got the pace, the long shots and everything just to run at defenders. And sometimes when he is running from deep, he can cause problems. But like I say, preferably if he had high medium or high low, he'd be getting in behind all the time. And that would make him a better card in my opinion. But aside from that... This guy is absolutely unreal. He is a lightning when he's on the ball. Electric. He is so, so quick. It's unbelievable. And when you combine that with his fantastic dribbling and his ball control being absolutely sensational, it feels like it's just stuck to him. And he can just walk around defenders, run past them with absolute ease. And that is probably the biggest positive that this card's got. Weak foot being a five-star is also absolutely fantastic. And he does also come with some insane shooting stats. He's got great shot power, crazy long shots, and insane finishing as well, which means when this card does get around the box in the the box anywhere even near the goal he is absolutely deadly which is why overall we're going to be giving this second inform son an 8.9 out of 10 he's currently going on xbox for just shy of 400k which isn't cheap and i would say with team of the season being not far away as well it might be worth holding off because he will without doubt get a better card because i cannot see this son not getting a, uh, a team of the season and with the other being other cards as well that are striker cards I would still recommend getting this one if you wanted to play him up front and just literally convert it into a left forward and playing him there just slightly off King because I still think his stats then will be better than his current, stri current striker cards if that makes sense. But that is going to round up this player of your lads. Like I said at the start, be sure to leave a massive thumbs up if you did enjoy and I'll speak to you all tomorrow with a brand new episode of the Road to Glory. So catch you all there lads. Enjoy the rest of your day. Need you out. Yo, his niche plays with big games and player reviews are getting insane. He entertains while he elevates his video quality resonates on career mode. He got lots of vids uploading off and he's rocking it. He's got the confidence in all his commentaries. Videos range, they often vary. Got need for speed and a road to glory. Just watching vids and you know the story. The content is underrated. I'm understating, so don't ignore the like and subscribe.